Right, it is 6.25, I'm here in London. Uh, I've got three days left here in London. Um, and this is just a message to explain that like, I got up, I got up at five this morning and I immediately just rolled over, put, picked up a book, I think reading Virtual Freedom by, I can't remember his name, anyway. Um, and got up at five, read for half an hour. Uh, I'm up now, going for a walk to get a coffee. It's fucking dead, it's absolutely dead. No one around. It's a beautiful morning here. Um, but the point of this video is that I didn't used to do this. So a year ago when life was very tough, I was probably getting up at 7.30. There were times even earlier in the year where I was I would be, I would have a couple of drinks every single night just to help me get rid of the stress. I didn't read. I didn't journal every morning like I do. I didn't write down my goals every morning like I do. I didn't read affirmations like I do every morning. I didn't craft my, my future vision script for how, I want, how my life is. on a different, a different timeline to what I was on. And the point is, is that I am a different person now than I was back then. Um, just had a notification come through that I just had an, another enrollment call scheduled. Um, yeah, 12 months ago, I was probably averaging one to two high ticket clients a month. And yesterday, as of this month, and I think it's the 17th, it looks like we're on track to bring in 12. Um, and I have to, I have, it is because, it's because of all of those changes that I made over this past year. I am a different person. I have replaced automatic negative thoughts with automatic positive thoughts so I've replaced words like hard difficult grind you know it's funny because I used to have this saying with my friends you know when we, we both with a couple of few of our friends started business at the same time and we always used to say always be grinding <laughs> um, and I think there's something fun at the start about that but I've replaced those words now, hard, difficult, work, grind with effortless, easy, flow, fun. And I now no longer think of, and I, I genuinely believe this now. I believe that there is no such thing as a problem. I believe all you have to make are decisions. A problem is simply a decision that you need to make. It's funny because this is the last couple of days here in London and every single morning I've walked, in the past year I've walked past here and I posted a photo on Instagram. You may have seen it if you follow me on Instagram. I don't know why, it's those two towers and I used to live, I used to live down there. Um, now I live on this side of the river, looking over where I used to live. And I'm about to go leave London. I don't know where I'm going to go. I can go wherever I want in the world. And I'm going to go somewhere warm. I'm going to go somewhere sunny because that was always my dream. My dream was always to be able to leave the UK during October to March. Uh, go somewhere warm during October to December and then go probably live in the Alps. Uh, to ski from January to March and then come back to my favorite place on earth, which is home It's home um, During summer where I genuinely believe there's no better place on earth than the UK in summer um, And so I'll be back um, But in between then I don't know where I'm gonna go So hey pop something in the comments. Tell me where I should go but I just felt compelled because this is my, I've got two more of these walks before I leave on Saturday. Um, and it's such a beautiful morning today. 
and it's dead. And I thought I'd kind of share with you my thoughts about how much you can change your life in a year if you if you do all the things that people always talk about, but to me, they never made sense. And now I get it. Um, I think when you start this journey, you're always expecting, you're always thinking it's all about the tactics. It's all about the strategy. Oh, that person's doing this. I need to be doing that. I need to be doing that. And again, I'm, I'm going to be the fucking, the motherfucking entrepreneur out here who says, tells you that everything works. So if you choose to do the model that I do, um, you're making a choice just to live your life in a certain way. You know, for me, I don't do cold email, cold DMs. I don't do anything like that, which requires uh, human capital effort. I use high leverage, um, high leverage lead generation tactics that involve using my money, like ads and content. So, um, everything works. You just have to choose the thing that's going to work for you. Um, but I'm just here saying in two days time, you know, that, that there's a bridge then train goes across it. And I used to get commute over there two years ago, two and a half years ago. Now, three years ago now it was close to when I stopped commuting and I used to have to get a train for two days, two hours a day. And I'd have to cross that bridge, get the train from over there. And now I'm about to leave London and being able to do whatever the fuck I want and literally go live the dream that I, I'm living my dream, I'm living my dream. I work with absolutely, I work with dream clients. Like the last couple of days, the caliber of people that I brought into our, uh, into my experience at scale 20 is insane. And it's only going to get better. Um, and the lesson here is that I have architected my dream life. Um, I've used a toolkit that I've taught, I've learned from other people and I've figured out what works for me. It's part of what I, um, I give, give to my clients because the big lesson here is that you can architect your reality. And you just need to have absolute full belief that that is the case and then learn the skills to do it. Okay, champs. This is me signing out. Have a banging day. And I'll see you in the next one. That was sick, by the way. Can't fucking forget that, can I? <laughs>